The COLS group is a, a very diversified group um, that operates mainly in, uh, in Haiti and produces and distributes uh, for the Haitian market. We have been in existence since 1989. We started with a beverage company called Tropic SA. Tropic has grown over the years from a company producing roughly 20,000 cases a month to today close to a million cases of product a month. Tropic SA evolves and produces an array of products that touches almost every category in the beverage industry in Haiti. Uh, we produce water, we produce uh, carbonated soft drinks, we produce steel drinks, juices. Uh, we are the, actually, we are the, the, the sole franchisees for the brand Tampico in Haiti. Uh, we produce energy drinks. Uh, we produce Malta. With the growth uh, of the Haitian economy, and uh, the need for more investments in, uh, in area to substitute for products that were imported, the Coles Group decided to invest in other areas of consumer products. In 2005, the Coles Group seized the opportunity to invest in uh, other consumer products. Namely, we invested in Sun Food, which is the only manufacturer in Haiti of bouillon cubes and tablets. Although it was facing competition from multinationals like Nestle and Unilever, Sun Food over the past seven years has gradually increased its market share and today um, pretty much dominates that market with over 50 or 60 percent of the, of the share of the market. Um, we are currently investing more in, uh, in, uh, in capacity and producing various brands for the local market as well as subcontracting for local customers. In 2011, the Coles Group invested in uh, Canex SA, which is the only manufacturer of dairy products in Haiti. Canex is a Tetra Pak plant, and in, in association, in partnership with Tetra Pak, we have managed to develop a, a, a small portfolio of very successful products for the Haitian market, namely evaporated milk and a high-protein dairy shake. Which is, uh, which is pretty much a meal replacement drink uh, consumed by all kinds of uh, um, end consumers in Haiti. The Coles Group also invested in a manufacturer of electronic tablets called Shortab. That, uh, that company has been the, the darling of all the media, the media circuits all over the world um, because it's, it's very, it was always very unlikely that, that a tablet to compete with the iTab or Samsung could be produced in a country like Haiti. And we have been very successful at, at launching the product and we are, we are actually um, partnered with, with uh, very large telecommunication companies in Haiti who, who use our tablets to, to further uh, penetrate the market of, the, of data consumption in Haiti. As a way to integrate our supply chain, the Coles Group, I should say, decided to purchase a company called Timbar, which is uh, the largest cotton corrugated box uh, company in Haiti. Uh, this, this makes us the only company capable of producing the packaging for our, for our beverages. The largest employer of the Coles Group is uh, Multiware Multitex. This company employs over 2,400 people who manufacture clothing goods for American companies. We receive the goods, cut, we sew them and re-export them. Um, Overall, the Coles Group is very proud to be the provider of over 4,500 jobs in the country. Uh, we are a very heavy contributor to, to the tax base of the government 
and uh, very proud to be part of this economy in this country. If you're watching these clips of my introduction of the various companies, it's because the Coles Group has decided to export some of the products that we make in Haiti. We are very proud of the quality and the processes used for the manufacture of our products and believe that the know-how that we developed over the years will allow us to penetrate some export markets and offer you some of the best products in those categories that you've seen.